Hey, what's going on? What's happening, everybody? As always, I'm DJ Wesper. I hope everybody's having a terrific day, and welcome back to another episode of my Five Friday Faves. This week, I'd like to share with you my personal top five DJ pool picks. I chose these five particular DJ pools mainly because I've tried them out and or used them for a period of time personally. And like anything else out there, they all have their pros and cons. But what they do offer the subscribers, no matter which one you choose to go with or try out, they do offer a lot for what you're paying for. And for those of you out there that don't know what a DJ pool is, it's basically a subscription-based service that you pay a monthly fee to have access to whatever they offer and that fee can vary you know depending on what service you, you choose to go with or what package because a lot of them are i guess you want to call it tiers um because a lot of them offer different i guess like i said tiers where you know the bottom tier you you'll have access to certain things but not everything where the top tier you'll have access to everything and this is where i personally believe that dj pools are more valuable to the beginner or newer DJ because as a beginner or newer DJ you're not going to have a library probably or what library you do have is not going to be probably nearly big enough to go out gigging with. And a DJ pool affords the newer beginner DJ the opportunity to either build their initial library or expand upon the one that they already have for the same monthly nominal fee. So it doesn't matter if you're downloading one song a month, 10 songs a month, 100 songs a month, 1,000 songs a month, it's still that same monthly nominal fee. And trust me, in the beginning, you're gonna be downloading a lot of music. And this say for argument's sake, you're paying $50 a month for a particular DJ pool service. It might sound like a lot for a monthly subscription, but if you're downloading 500 songs a month, which like I said in the beginning, you're going to be downloading a lot of music at 500 songs a month and you're only paying 50 bucks for it. That's a lot cheaper than buying one song here or there through like iTunes or Amazon or, or any of the other services that are out there. But anyway, here are my top five DJ pool picks.
Well, those are my top five DJ pool picks. If you're using a particular DJ pool or even multiple DJ pools and it ain't making my top five and you'd like to share, drop in the comments below. I'm always curious to see what other DJs are using out there. Well, thanks for stopping by. I hope you liked the video. And if you did, please hit that like button. Well, that's it for this week's My Five Friday Faves. Thanks for watching, and I'm out of here.